Hello and welcome back to Let's Try. We're trying Bleed Prince Academy. I don't honestly know much about this. I know it's got some some JRPG elements and I know it's got some Persona elements, but I don't know if uh, if the comparisons end there. But it looked it looked charming from what I saw on, of the of the trailer of the screenshots. What's happening here? Who dared to attack the Academy? My brother, so many dead. I need to find survivors. I do like the art style. It's just like immediately. Uh, it's my lucky day. There's still one of them alive. The boss will be happy. It, it does feel kind of um, influenced somewhat by uh, Hades. Some of the the shading, and I say like shading, but like some of the shadows, dynamic lighting on. I don't. It's not dynamic lighting. So I guess just the way they've drawn the lighting on the characters reminds me of Hades a little bit. It's my lucky day. There's still one of them alive. The boss will be happy. Okay. You have entered a tactical pause where you can analyze and queue up your actions. Press spacebar to enter and exit the tactical pause. Um, okay, so we've got we've got auto combat. What the hell are the acid pills doing in the ma Black Mage Palace? It makes no sense. So we right click to move around. We are smashing pots for, for gold. Classic. Love that. Love that for me. Love to smash pots for gold. One of my favorite pastimes, honestly. They've done some graffiti on these, uh, Gargama, Gargama goils. Alright, more combat. Here we go. Zahaha, what do you think you're doing? You want to go on a ride with me? We've already slaughtered lots of you brats, and the boss said to bring him, him any still breathing. Okay. You'll die by my blade, you bastard. If you attack the blade princess... Princess? Sorry. Death is all you deserve. We'll see about that, little one. Mad dogs, grab that insect. Attack with the skill whirlwind of blades to eliminate the dogs. Okay, so we're gonna... we're gonna zoot. Zoot zap, left click on the ground to use the skill. Press space to exit tactical pause. Boop! Um... Well, why did it stop? Press space to exit. I, I'm, I'm trying. I guess it stopped because I had done the attack. And we don't have uh, that again for a bit. Okay. My dogs, damn you. Pathetic little puppet of the mages. I'm the sword of the shadows. Or in the shadows. Zah, no time to play with you, little one. Gotta go, zah Okay, goodbye. See ya. Take it easy. Stay hydrated, honestly. It's, it's getting hot out there, you know? No, come back here, you coward. <laughs> okay. I like uh, some of the comic-isms we've got. You know, the pop, zash, zoop, kapow. Attack an enemy from behind with right-click to perform a double, uh, a backstab and double your damage. Okay. Do it. Backstab. Um, what's this? Sharp dive. Dash in with your sword, dealing 15 physical damage at the end of point. I don't think we need to do that. We'll just we'll just attack them. That's it. Find Ethelion and and kill the bandits. Poof. We've got a chesto. Who will open the chest? Phoebus. <laughs> Phoebes. Um. All right. So we've got some. Is this? This isn't a. This 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 couldn't possibly be another roguelike, could it? say it ain't so no it's not sorry you'll have to excuse me i've played so many games with this screen that are roguelikes it it seemed odd to me so less mana but more life steal and life max this seems to be the uncommon one a lot of a lot of games are using this now like common and uncommon picks um i don't dislike it but i i can see that mechanic getting saturated I'm not liking some of these other ones. We've got to, uh, we've got a mechanic that I'm not generally fond of, which is like everything comes with a downside. Yeah, I guess it makes min maxing a bit more um, intuitive, but at the same time, I just prefer you know to to have skills that I want to take rather than ones that I have to like. I don't know, deliberate the downsides rather than the, the upsides. Uh, okay. So we're we're over here. 
There's lots of lads here. Queuing up your actions during the tactical pause to defeat your enemies. Your actions are queued and will be performed after exiting tactical pause. Press the space bar to enter exit tactical pause. Um, oh, I see. So when I'm in tactical pause, everything I do is a, um, is queued up. Okay, so I could like run in here, attack that, and then run back. But did it do it? It didn't do it. There we go. Okay, so now we've got a bunch of extra lads. Um, let's do uh, one of those jump in strikes. Um, like right there. And then we'll do a, a whirlwind right after. Seems good. Didn't really work because the uh, the enemies were moving while while I was uh, moving in. But I mean, like I guess that's that's the point. You're gonna you're gonna have to try and figure those things out. You'll have to gauge where you want to, to your your attacks to land, assuming that the enemy is going to move. I'm getting lots of skull coins. Who's this? Oh no! Vile. Tile? Good timing, my friend. We're in deep shit. I was looking for you for everywhere. Uh, our room has felt really empty since you left. Sorry, buddy. I don't have time to explain everything. I wasn't planning on coming back for a while, but I sensed something shady was going on. And when I arrived, those acid pill junkies were attacking the Black Mage Palace. You'd better tell me everything that's happened since you left, and no bullshitting, I'm not the headmistress. I'll explain everything, I promise, but not now. It would be unwise. I suspect an un influential organization is involved. I'm glad to see you again. Let's go and save everyone we can, okay. So we have group selection. You can select several characters by left-clicking and hovering over them. Oh, okay, yeah, gotcha. Um, or by pressing tab. So wait a minute, if I click on him, I can tab. Oh no, tab just selects everyone. Okay. You can also spe select specific characters um, by pressing one or two. Okay, so one, two, one, two, tab, gotcha. Decent. I appreciate uh, our controls here. Okay, so we've got some enemies over there. I assume those cones mean enemies. We'll definitely want to do um, like a sneak in. So let's do a tactical pause. Um, we're gonna have Phoebus run in there and then attack this lad. And then this guy, we're gonna have him. What does he got? Quick blade thru uh, thrust, dealing bleed and physical damage. Or throw three blood projectiles, dealing 13 magical damage and bleed. Okay, I wonder if I can cancel my last move. How how would one cancel? Mm, I, I just came to be seem to be queuing up more. Oh, okay. Shift plus right click to cancel. Okay, yeah. So what we want to do is throw. Um, I wonder if those have a range. Range two hundred. Okay, shift. Let's 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 cancel that. Um. Let's like get no that's that's bad. We don't want to get in that range. Get over there and then do a nice crimson thing to that to the guys behind there. All right. And then um, I guess we could do a thrust. Let's see how this goes. Yeah, I mean that that worked out pretty well. Just want to make sure that they are attacking them. It looks like they are. Um, Phoebus has taken some damage. You can apply alterations with your skills. Alterations are extra effects that can deal damage over time or decrease your enemy's stats. Be careful, enemy skills can also apply alterations. So are we poisoned right now? Receive three poison damage every two seconds reduced by armor. So I think we are poisoned. Let's get in a whirlwind. Um, 
and we'll get in we'll get in there with our other friend let's uh cue in an attack um, a movement just so that we're not moving through the poison oh shoot that whirlwind did nothing Okay, this uh, this combat did didn't really work too well. Or at least it wasn't it wasn't as optimal as the last one. We took a little bit of damage. I mean, it's the beginning of the game, so they're going to be very um, forgiving. I don't know if uh, he was attacking at that point. So we're poisoned. It's fine. We got a key. Stop being poisoned. Okay, good. Um, all right, so I feel like we can do this combat down here a little bit easier if we move around here because then we can get double damage So let's just like get in position And then I'm just gonna attack we'll do it. We'll do a normal attack Nice that worked out well We'll just like continue with an attack. We'll we'll do um, we could do some like extra stuff here. So the range seems to be farther than what I thought. Um, let's like do some extra stuff. We don't have to just like stand still and attack, because we can like avoid their attacks as well, right? We could kill this guy before he gets his attack off then that would be ideal yeah there we go now we'll just like you know go double dip on that dog so yeah the, the combat's pretty cool so far I'm, I'm i'm enjoying this um this you know positioning matters it kind of reminds me of some miniatures games You can you can avoid attacks if you like actually care to try I'm, I'm really trying I was really trying to just attack the dude. I don't know Like I was really unable to just click on the guy. So I'm not sure if that's a you know, it's an it's an early iteration. Maybe it's my my bad, but uh, I tried quite hard to, to attack that lad All right jars I'm attacking all the jars. I have like, um, it's a, it's a funny, you know, it's difficult balance to strike. I think when you have, uh, destructible things in your game that give you stuff, because then the, the player is going to spend a lot of time destroying basically everything, or they won't do it at all. And then are, are you balancing your game to make sure that they have enough coins or so like, it's a weird thing. I've, I have noticed in a lot of games where it's like, uh, as soon as I know there's anything in jars, I spend a lot of time breaking like every barrel, bucket, jar, box, crate, you know. Um, so it's a, it's a tricky, tricky one. What's the symbol again? It reminds me of something. If you'd pay more attention in class and re you'd remember, it's a symbol of Arachnia, the goddess of suffering, a cult that has its tentacles all over the continent of Monstrogo. Sorry for wanting to pay attention to the reality and dangers of field operations. Uh, theological teaching doesn't exactly get my adrenaline flowing. We got potions. Heck yeah, potions. Um, we have more potions than we can carry. That's a, that's curious that they would give us more potions than we can carry. Bam. Uh, do we have a key? A door blocks your the way. You can open it with a key, destroy it, or come back. I don't know what happens if we destroy it, so let's just use a key. I know we got a key. Okay, we got a boss fight. Nowhere to run now. Zaha, you and your little friend are too late. You'd, you'll pay for what you've done. Come on then, kiddies. I've had an, I've enough juice in my blood to take two of you at once. Acid hair, I think I'll start with your tongue so I can shut you up for good. Okay. So let's avoid that attack and then um, 
get in from behind maybe we can get i don't know if they have to be it has to be an unaware attack um and then we'll just like oh it's z i thought it was a we'll do a couple of these oh did he already get his attack off oh is there flanking in this game love that love flanking Backstab. Okay, so you do you can get backstabs um, without Without them being unaware. Okay, so this, that guy's got a range. I I'm standing right in the poison, but that's I'm just gonna I'm just gonna tank it. I'm gonna face it face tank it Easy till next time kiddos. I'll be taking my leave now arachnia has her eye on you. I can't believe it. That damn rat slipped right through our fingers. What is he? Is he crying blood? He just wanted to buy enough time to evacuate the hostages. We've been fooled like chumps. Let's get back to the academy quickly to get some backup. We'll scour the whole of <laughs> Abjectalia to hunt down that freak if we have to. Our Thale? It's nothing. It's okay. Just a nas nasty migraine. You go back to the academy. I need to continue my investigation. I have contacts in the shallows that could help us. See you soon. Athelion, wait. Can you at least tell me who's behind all this? No time. You'll know soon enough, bro. I need to find Oren. I'm sure he she survived. Funky names, yo. <laughs> at least she's reliable. I can count on her help to track down that damned acid hair. Victory. I mean, this is pretty cool. I mean, we, we got a lot of world building. Um, I, my, my, my brain is just like numb from world building. Cause like I, the last like 10 to 20 games or demos I've played in the last two days. It's just, it's just a lot is the do the world is plunged into darkness. Nothing, nothing wrong with this game at all. And it's, it's just, it's just me, honestly. So uh, if I seem unenthused by the story, it's not the game at all. I promise you. Blade Prince, uh, Blade Princes. I keep reading that as princess. I know it's not. Bow before the Lord of Abjectalia, Zian Taurus. My dear children, yesterday's events put the future of Abjectalia at risk. We've not witnessed depravity of this magnitude in 300 moons. Vos frères ont et unless. Okay, that's a lot. Our enemies committed a fatal error. Your brother, Athelion, un. <laughs> wait. Was that supposed to be in English? I'm, I'm, I'm actually not sure now. The Brotherhood of Torments, a cult of heretics who serve the goddess Arachnia. We will hunt our enemies down and destroy them. As of now, we are at war. Glory to Abjectalia. Glory to the Academy. Okay, cool. So we've got... Um, game kind of reminds me of that other one I was I played this year at demon school I can't it had some other subtitle but it was mostly just demon school use the recruiting office to recruit new heroes you can upgrade the recruiting office to increase the number of heroes yo we got like semi XCOM uh, downtime that'd be kind of cool yo this guy is actually legit I like uh, I like I'm, I'm, I'm appreciating some of his character designs Selena We've definitely got a compromising um, art style. It's, it's a little bit of a divide between like an anime and um, yeah, I did hear um, comparisons to like Disgaea, which I did play the first Disgaea. I didn't really play too much more Disgaea, but I, I do appreciate the world. And um, I actually really, I, I wish other games would just like rip off some of the mechanics from Disgaea and do them in a different or repackaged way. Because I do like this guy, but I don't love this guy. <laughs> um, use the alchemy lab to add effects and buy potions. Upgrade the alchemy lab to boost the efficiency and number of your potions. Okay, anti-poison. That's the only thing I seem to be able to buy right now. So I'll buy that. And then I can buy two of those. Oh, no, and I can buy no more. Anti-bleed, anti-burn. So I guess, um, in addition to healing us, um, you can get the potion to do all anti-effects. It seems rather, 
I feel like this is something I shouldn't be able to upgrade like this quickly. But we're good. I think we're good. Start a mission. Ooh, I like this screen. I, yeah, I really like the art, the, the, the style they're going for. It's, it's really nice. It's, it's pretty slick. I gotta say. Phoebus is required for this mission. I have Phoebus. Oh, I see. I have to select the team. Well, let's select Oren. And, uh, I like this, uh, Vecchio character. I think they look pretty cool. We notice that the Acid Pills gang is taking bolder actions against us. You have to put them back in their place. Kill bandits to secure the area. Enemies have little magic resistance. Enemies have strong physical resistance. Enemies have physical damage. So I would assume I would want to, if I was being very clever, um, look at each of these characters and decide, okay, are they magic or are they physical? And then create a, a better team comp. You can look at your hero's stats and packs on their character screen. Um, you can also change their skills and acquire talents. Cool, I wonder, did Phoebus level up Phoebes? <laughs> so they can do some new stuff. They could possibly do ch burning chains. Create a link of burning flames with an enemy, dealing burn and eight magic damage. Let's try that. We seem to already have that, so let's, let's give it a go. Sorry, just had to sneeze there. No worries. Precision shot, physical damage. Oh yeah, what does Phoebus do? Magic damage. Just had to sneeze again. It's all good. Don't worry, I'm not dying. Yeah, we want to we want to go to magic damage, I think. This is physical damage. Um and then Oren seems to do physical damage. Um, we might want to swap them out for Selena. I'm assuming is magic. I don't know why in the world I would assume that, but yeah, they seem to do magic damage. Okay, so let's swap out. Let's back uh, back to the hub and um, swap out Oren for Selena. There we go. Oren is required for this mission. Okay. <laughs> okay. As, it, as soon as I try to apply some forward thinking strategy, it's fine. The orders from the Black Mages are clear. What happened yesterday at the Academy must never happen again. We must hit back hard and end the acid pills threat for good. These scums are about to carry out a pillaging raid. Let's take this chance to destroy them without warning. I hope Phoebus... <laughs> Someone's gonna give me a, a hard time because I'm mispronouncing that like every time. We'll live up to your expectations. And if I may speak my mind, Headmistress, as number two of the Blade, Blades Academy, I'm wondering why the B Brotherhood of Torments would want to ally themselves with these acid pill junkies. It makes sense to me. They're just con uh, cannon fodder. It means the Brotherhood doesn't need to get its hands dirty. The acid pills are just pawns. Diamante. The plan makes perfect sense. Athelion, finally you're back. It's time you ended this annoying habits of yours of coming and going like the school is a magic garden brothel. Last warning, boy. But headmistress, I'm just applying what you taught me. My ability to disappear and reappear at just the right time makes me one of the best assets the Blade Princes have. One of the best, but not the best. Who's the best? Is it me? Am I the best? I'm the best. Confirmed. All right. As father said, it's time for revenge. We'll crush these vermins and make them wish they'd never been, a never attacked the blade, blade princes. Going on a slaughtering spree is no fun. I'm not even talking about the smell of the corpses. I prefer more subtle operations. You're, you're, uh, you heard Taurus and Magda, Mag. Malgadore. <laughs> these, are, these are some names. Their orders are clear. Eradicate the scum without delay. Should be up to the Skadrons to handle that. It's not our job to collect the garbage. I disagree. Oren, this mission is of the highest importance. So our main character, Phoebus, is kind of a hothead. Oren seems a little bit more calculated. Um, Vecchio is a redshirt. 
Uh, Y'all pray for Vecchio. They're not making it. They don't get dialogue. They don't get to... They don't get anything. They get to look cool while they die. Okay, let's, um... I'm gonna just, like, carefully walk around this. I'm sure, I'm sure we could just, like, avoid combat completely. But what's the fun in that? We're gonna, we're gonna have them all attack at once. Actually, Phoebus... Not Phoebus. Oren doesn't need to, uh... Wait. She can just attack. Um... We'll just have them attack normally. Fight! Um, we can do a Whirlwind of Blades. I don't know if, like, that costs mana. Probably it does. And, but it does do physical damage. Oh yeah, this this is working for me. This is this is working for me. No one I don't think anyone really took any damage there. Do you recover health after you exit combat? Kind of feels like you do. Or maybe I just took so little damage that I can't tell. Oh, we've got um enemies at patrol. On patrol, I'm on patrol. Okay. Um, let's take a shot. E mm. Yeah, we'll just have to take a shot. We, we don't really have too much in the way of um, ranged attacks. I like the little characterisms when you like get, use an attack. So, yes, use that. I like that. Absorb all the blood around you, removing all bleed and healing. 3 HP for every bleed stack removed. Oh, interesting. So he removes bleeding. Um, but then, and then also gets healing from it. I, I kind of like that. I haven't seen that too many times before, but like removing status effects, but then benefiting from that as well. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. No, oh, no, no, no. Stop this. I want to go there and attack from behind. Did I just shoot my own lad? Is there friendly fire in this game? Receive one bleed damage every two seconds. Well, so now blood leech would be really good. Yeah, it seems like uh, we are all taking bleeding right now. So now would have been perfect to, to use that a special ability. All right, let's um, back up. Back away from that attack. It does seem like you can very much undermine a lot of attacks by just like moving out of the way. Okay, we're we're full, but why don't we go ahead and use Oh, I guess it uses it on whoever's selected. Yeah. Yeah, it does. And now I've I've wasted a potion. Okay. There's one more of these lads. I'd like to uh, destroy that other one that was wandering around. What happened to them? What happened to the other uh the other dude? The other patrolling dude? Hmm. Weird. Okay. He's just gone. I am going around in the hopes that I can, like, get those guys from behind, but it doesn't look like I can. That being said, I can do these guys for sure. Okay. A little bit finicky to select certain things. I know we can just use the numbers. Um, but it's still like, I, I guess I keep trying, hoping I don't have to. Okay. So we want to move them out of the way. I think it's a good time to use a, a whirlwind. So 
what do we got here blood leech we don't need blood leech bleeding let's do a good old bleeding attack i guess that does uh that's a local attack just gonna have uh oren solo the dog over here okay they're done over there go ahead and finish the dog we're done half of them are still left although it's true that there's a lack of inquisitors and scadrons in the area we could have done with their help stop moaning i thought you were the school's number one yeah well there's a lot of enemies to deal with Who's going to open this? Let's have Phoebus. Less armor, less magic resistance, more attack, more evade. Life, max. Yeah, I mean, like, I, I've said this before, but when every single uh, thing has, like, a downside, it just doesn't feel good taking stuff, you know? At least not for me. Um, welcome to disagree with me, for sure. Ooh, we got new lads. Ooh, very new. Oh, that, that's a merchant. I wish I had taken my, um, my dash attack. I, it worked quite well for, you know, situations like this. Can we do something like this. And then we'll get them to run behind and attack from behind. I do like that backstab is like a thing and flanking is a thing. Um, how's Oren doing? They seem to be kind of taking some nasty damage. I haven't really tried to use their second attack. Oh, it's use a medical magical curative dis, uh this this positive <laughs> why 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 do we need such big words to mean like health pack it's fine um so phoebus is poisoned this i like this guy just i guess he is attacking All right. I mean, it's going well. Make sure we've got someone from behind attacking, getting that flank bonus. Can we get them to do a bleeding quick blade thrust dealing ble bleed damage? Um, I, I clearly don't know how to use that attack just yet. Okay, so Phoebus, you can use a health potion, then we can take that other health potion. Are those other ones to grab or are they money? Do we have enough to buy that chest? No, we don't. So let's just like pass on that stuff over there for now. I wouldn't mind buying the chest, but that's about it. Ooh, new enemy. They look pretty cool um let's just like get a easy shot off and then we'll go in okay so there is friendly fire <laughs> there is just straight up friendly fire i didn't expect that these kind of games generally don't have friendly fire um i respect the decision it's it's you know but i i, I don't think maybe maybe they told me there was friendly fire but i really just didn't know that there was friendly fire I think that's pretty funny actually just like just 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 stay right there I'm gonna shoot you okay as soon as that shot goes goes off we're gonna go in and we're gonna make sure we're going from behind actually let's uh cancel that stay right there do a chain this seems like it would be a good idea 
move you out of the way. Make sure, make sure you're always getting that flanking. And I think probably always focus on like one enemy at a time. You can move out of the way. This guy seems tougher than the dog in some ways. Maybe we should have focused them first. Oh, okay, so they were in, within range of that. These guys are dodging all my attacks right now. Or do dodging a lot of attacks. Backstab, good one. I need a break. I feel like I've not stopped fighting since the acid pills attack. A little rest would be very welcome right now. Rules are rules. We go on a w mission. We give, all our, uh, give our all until the very end. I know. Now I'd like to understand how the acid pills are so well organized. It's pretty incredible for a bunch of junkies. They must have some kind of encrypted or secret technology to coordinate them. All this technology makes me laugh. I just let Moon guide me. Yeah. Well, let's hope Moon helps us catch acid hair. What should we do? Go for a drink at the Magic Garden? Return to the Ad Academy for rest. Just go for a drink. Plus two, re relation. These the, these y'all and, and red shirt here likes... likes uh, Let's go for a drink. Okay, a little drink wouldn't hurt. Victory. Oh, that's it? Keep exploring. I, th I, I figured there was more. I didn't think that that was the last combat. There is more. There's another combat here. Mills will do it. Why not? Okay, let's get over here and um, do a bleeding thing. Uh, that bleeding doesn't... A quick blade thrust dealing bleed damage. It doesn't seem to... I mean, I'll, is it doing it now? Yeah, I guess so. I don't know. Yeah, I did do it because it's off cooldown. I do find um, it's it's a little finicky sometimes to, to actually click on stuff. Oh, I was hoping to avoid that. This, is the, this uh, combat seems a little bit spicier, but then again, I'm like still not taking basically any damage. I haven't used Blade of Winds for a while. But I, I think I would rather use this chain attack. Let's make sure we're avoiding these attacks. And actually, can we, let's um, have them aim at that because we'll get the flanking and we'll probably take them out. I do appreciate that it just tells you how much damage you're going to do. Like it shows their health bar changing. Yeah, again, it's like, I don't know. Maybe I'm, I shouldn't be aiming for the model. I should be aiming for the base. But I find it really difficult to uh, click on certain people sometimes. Um, let's do a heal pack on Oren. Just to see what that looks like. There we go. These guys aren't doing anything right now because I didn't want to just like walk them into attacks and stuff, but maybe I should have. Kill, kill them. Yes. So it seems like, um, I, I don't know. Like, I don't think this is a procedurally generated dungeon. I don't know, but it feels a little procedurally generated. I won't lie. Let's have Oren uh, open this up. Mana max, but less mana regen. Uh, attack speed, more life max, less 
armor and less magic resistance. Well, I mean, this seems pretty good. All right, let's return to the academy. I guess um, my concern is kind of that the dungeon seems so generically laid out that it, it kind of does feel roguelike-ish. Like it feels like it's procedurally generated, but I actually can't tell. Children, we have confirmation that the acid pills have been able to synchronize their attacks using a secret communication network. The next objective will be to destroy this intergang communication center. I knew it. It seems so strange they were so well organized. And their leader, Acid Hair, do we know anything about him other than he's big and strong? According to the headmistress, he's a mutant gray elf, but the origins of his mutation are unknown. Be careful, he's a dangerous psychopath. An unhinged junkie addicted to delirium. Also seems he has a special interest in music. Oh no! Oh, good no, please, please don't. There are rumors that he's even tampered with an instrument and turned it into a weapon. Well, without anything sol solid on him, it's not going to be easy. We'll obviously do our best to finish off this stoner freak. If he's the leader of the acid pills, he can't be completely out of his mind, and he's definitely the most vicious and savage of them all. I'd really like to go with you on this hunt, but I need some rest. I'm exhausted. I'm off to the dormitory. There, there he goes, bleed, uh, crying blood again. After the debacle experienced by the Academy, it is an imperative that you learn to defend yourself against far greater dangers. Shit. The gardens, they... there are still signs of the massacre. And the smell of blood, it's so strong it's burning my nostrils. If only I'd been here to defend our brothers and not on a mission. We'll get revenge, and then some, I swear, Oren. Let's hur uh, hurry. Father's waiting for us. What do you mean, father? Oh, is he? Is that dude your dad? You brought us here to become stronger, right? Your incantation has unlocked something in us. I feel stronger. That's exactly why you're here, ch and children. The Blades Massacre is proof of your weakness, especially you, my son. Wow, I think I did pretty well. I was expecting far uh, more from the best student in the academy. I'm sorry I haven't lived up to your teaching. We needed your help, Lord Taurus. How could we have fought an attack as strong as that? Need I remind you that blade princes are supposed to protect ab Abjectalia. To be the best of the best, but you aren't even capable of pr protecting your own academy. Now be quiet and pay attention. I will teach you how to wield much more powerful and destructive powers uh, so a ca catastrophe like this of this magnitude can be nipped in the bud my goodness words but these powers have certain conditions i will teach you right now pay attention try and attack the skadron with your whirlwind, whirlwind of blades if i remember correct uh, correctly it's one of your signature moves yeah yeah it is um No, I want to go up to him and then do it. Your skill can inflict alterations to enemies. With the right alteration on a target, you can boost the power of your skills. I've cursed the Skadron with a taunt spell. Try and attack it again with your Whirlwind of Blades. My whirlwind of blades was so overpowered, so much stronger than the first time. Ah, Phoebus. Come on, son, you're stronger than that. Oh, Ren, get in position. Now that you've your camouflage, use your heal pack. It will get Phoebus back on his feet and have an additional effect. The poison? I didn't know. Why are we just like beating the crap out of Phoebus? I didn't know my heal pack could do this. Skadron is still taunted. Phoebus, use your fire link on it. It 
It's burning much more intensely. Good, good. There's still room for improvement, but you now have a solid foundation to build on. The next uh, step will be to pass on what you've learned of these arcane secrets to your blade brothers. It's easier than expected. I can't wait to test out these new powers on a proper mission. We'll train all the blades that are still able to fight. I swear I'll never disappoint you again. I would expect no less of you, Phoebus, but be careful, especially in the heat of the moment. He leveled, he's level 3 now. So we can see what uh, leveling up a character looks like. How do we look at the character sheet again? Okay, you got right click. So... Um, they, I guess they were already level 2. Now they're level 3, so they get to, uh, they get a talent boost. Stat choose. Choose one. Well, uh, let's go. I'm going to go for attack. And now I have fireball. Throw a piercing fireball dealing burn. Oh, and I have uh, access to more spell room. All right, let's, uh, tr oh, wait. Did it just like accidentally unlock that for me? I seem to have all my skill slots now. Let me just double check that. Yeah, okay, that was a that was a visual mistake. No one else leveled up yet, so um I don't think there's anything else I can do here. Oh, I can un I can uh, upgrade our potion stock and uh, potion effect. Those will, oh, we, oh, I see. I need these like cyber mods in order to do it. So it's not just money. Oh, here's a dude. Gadhu. So there's quite a lot of different, like, there's a lot of variety in the uh, characters you can recruit. They're a tank. Approved. And then we have Mackie. Mackie looks similar to Oren in some ways. Uh, what is, what is this over here? The graveyard can be used to resurrect your heroes. The cost decreases after each mission. Okay, that's that's kind of cool, actually. We could give ourselves some destiny points, whatever that means. All right, so let's do one more mission, and then um, oh, I see. So there's like a there's like quite a lot of mission here in this one city, and we get to four team members this time. Um, is Vecchio still hurt? Let's take Selena and Gadhu. There's team coherency. So like certain people like to be with certain people. We'll do one more mission and then I'll wrap this up. This, this seems like a game you could sink a lot of time into, honestly. The orders from the Black Mages are clear. What happened yesterday at the Academy must never happen again. We must hit back hard. Wait, didn't we already do this? I thought, I thought we did that. Did I pick the wrong mission? This is the Shallows. Time for revenge. We'll crush these vermin and make them wish they'd never attack. Yeah, we already did this. But it's it looks like a completely different uh, level. So do we have procedurally generated levels? No, it doesn't look like a different level. Okay. Um, is this layout different? Now I'm just curious. Uh, I don't abort mission. Let's let's abort mission. Okay, can we do a different mission? I don't think so. I think that that is actually the end of the demo. Oh no, I, was, I think I selected the wrong one. Okay, acid hair. Here we go. My bad. Acid hair is hiding in his last hole. We're close to sealing our revenge. The slaughter of the, the brotherhood inflicted on us didn't finish us off. It just made us stronger. My hackles go up when you speak like Taurus. 
Father made me the best of the Blade Princes, and with great power comes great responsibility. Oh yeah, Spider-Man? Okay. Let's go. Let's make the make the most of your great responsibilities as best student in the academy. Glory to the Blade Princes. Selena, you get dialogue? Glory to the Blade Princes. Okay, you guys get like backup dialogue. Okay. Okay. This is it, my friends. There's no escape for Acid Hair. I hope you'll be ready for a fight. We're not waiting for backup. No time. Acid Hair is just another of the Bla Brotherhood servants. The headmistress wants us to bring her his head as soon as possible. I think we can forget about sneaking in. We've been spotted. You brats, you thinking you'll be get the better of an old hand like me? This place is going to be your grave. Change of plan. Reinforce doors with a security system like this must have big generators. Find them and destroy them. Um, interesting change of plan. We went from like killing people to like quick the generators. Um, there is some forgiveness in being spotted. I noticed. Let's have Oren open this one up. Ooh, plus one alterations, plus one life max. Less haste. I mean, yeah, we got to go for the purple one. It's purple. I think they leveled up from that as well. So what kind of uh, moves does Selena have? Invoke moon's curative properties. Hit with the sharp moon's edge, dealing 15 magic damage and giving mana. If the target has fog, then cast supernova on the caster. Supernova is three projectiles orbiting around the caster dealing damages to enemies hit. So this is uh, what they were kind of just teaching me is that there's there's different effects depending on how you, um, you know, what kind of circumstance you put these attacks in. If the caster has bleed, then cast fire nova on the target. Um, it's going to be kind of difficult for me to keep all of this up in my head. The target has provocation, cast lightning strike on the target so like how do we have provocation i don't know if we have provocation slice demon shout scream at your enemies with all your killing intent dealing provocation and fit for the okay so there we go so we've got that um let's see if like is, is that an aoe it is an aoe so i actually think it would be a good idea to get our friend in here and like wake everyone into a frenzy and then prov uh, provoke them let's just like group everyone up and then we're gonna do a demon shout it's gonna put three of them in range i want to make sure that goes off first and then we're gonna start um lining up up, up attacks here we can even get that barrel in as well. We'll get our um, our, our lad over here. We'll do a whirlwind of blades, and it even lights it up, indicating that they are provoked, which is which is nice. Ooh, yeah, that is really nice. My goodness. And yeah, we'll want to get in there. Wow, yeah, that, that was kind of insane, actually. It's a good combo. And as long as we wait for cooldowns to come down, come back, then we should be able to do it quite often and just like absolutely destroy everything. Nice. We are done. The only one that took a little bit of damage was Gadhu, and we can use a potion on him. That potion does quite a lot now. You little worms, you got no chance. I suggest we start by destroying the speakers. He's yelling at us with, they're hurting my ears. No, we stay focused on the generators. Okay. I like the mushrooms. <laughs> We've got another store over here. Um, 
really don't really want to buy anything oh there's a free chest here though our threat level goes up okay that's interesting so depending on what you do your threat level goes up i'm not sure what that means but i'm gonna assume it means that the um difficulty of the enemies goes up or maybe it spawns more enemies okay so same plan actually let's um just for now we'll back up and then i'm gonna have oren attack this barrel oh my god see that's really not okay all right everyone back up oren i want you to attack this barrel see it really i really needed to just attack stuff it's it's become it's it's quite difficult to just like click on stuff i don't know if maybe i can't just attack that barrel and the my friend got in the way okay um let's undo that we're gonna walk in there and then do a provocation now why is it doing the provocate in the wrong area hold on a second i want to get them all in there and then um the fact that there's friendly fire just kind of bites but like you know when you actually get your ducks in a row you can you can do some crazy damage I do wish I could move around the map a little bit easier, like pan around. Okay, let's get everyone to kill this dog. Um, let's try this like mm, lunar crescent. I don't have any way to buff it. Like, I don't think I have any way of doing fog. But at the same, you know, it's it's still worth something to do that. We could go to the uh, oh, there's fog right here. Okay, so environmental effects actually can like help you do more damage. Yeah, I'm having a really hard time just like attacking stuff. I feel like it should not be that difficult. Berserker's rage, more attack speed, more life max. Yeah. You're gonna die, piss off. Don't listen to that coward. He knows his time is up. Just one more generator to destroy. We're almost there. Look at all these boxes I have to destroy. All right, one more generator and then we get to fight the boss. I like that Selena does like a little skip. That's a really nice little attention to detail. That certain, uh, you know, they, they have different kind of running animations. That's cute. I like that a lot. Okay, um, I'm just swapping between Phoebus and, and Oren, but maybe, I don't know, Gadhu is also proven to be very useful, so we could get them to do some stuff. Um, yeah. That is increasing our, our threat level. Okay, we got a combat in here. I'm assuming this is where the last generator is. That it indeed is. Just gonna like back up. And then, you know, move in. Okay, there we go. That's pretty good. Move in there. Um, not, that's not close enough. I need, I need this lad to get out of the way. Yo, I need you to move though. Okay, so now do, do that. And then you get in there and start doing your whirlwind. And I mean, he's not the only one that benefits from that. Um, we can do... Wait a minute. Cast guided bullets on the target. If it's in fog? 
if the caster is in fog why is this lit up i'm not in fog right now at least i don't think i am oh i guess i am interesting okay well yeah why not why not do that and then uh why can't we do you don't have enough mana oh no all right i wasted i kind of semi wasted that let's uh do some more stuff I just like doing stuff you know it's fun i like doing stuff why didn't you do your fireball i thought the whole point was to like queue stuff up ah you got knocked back out of the way we're still apparently in fog so let's uh do this moon's caress on phoebus not phoebus sorry oren to heal her and then that means cast eclipse on the caster uh salvatory eclipse cleansing burn and healing to the target okay i am just like enjoying comboing stuff it's it's pretty good we do need more uh mana though this guy's doing a hecka big explode right now heckin big explode um we haven't really done this if the caster has burn cast sleep tight on the target oh well, i don't know if we have you know we don't have burn so we'll just like use it all right we're good there everyone group up on this guy this you know we don't we don't want to take an extra attack for no reason That flanking is quite good. Oh, everyone got backstab flanking. That was great. Nice. Um, okay, so everyone's got their mana back. Yeah, this, this game is really cool. I like this a lot. I don't believe it. We did it. You're worse than flies buzzing around shit. Nothing but puppets. You bastard, I'm gonna kill you. You'll die fighting me. It'll be harder than with my pills. Blade Prince's move forward. All right. We've got two chests in here. I'm going to double down on Phibus. Phibus. Poison resistance, armor, magic resistance, less poison. They really want us to have less poison, uh, less poison resistance. I'm just going to up my attack. And critical chance, apparently. Our threat level is going up by a lot. I don't know what that means, but I maybe assume that the boss is going to be a lot harder. Let's go to the store. I honestly just had a morbid curiosity. Want to find out um, what happens if we get the threat level all the way up. And I'm assuming if we go to the store and buy that last chest. That uh, it'll put the threat level up even higher. All right, let's buy this. Demon demonic prophecy. Um, assign the pact to a hero. Let's, um, yeah, let's put it on. I don't know. Let's put it on Gadhu. Why not? No, no threat level. Not didn't see any threat level go up. Well, that's kind of disappointing, actually, because uh, how do you get the threat level up high enough to, to see it? make a meaningful difference that uh, fog seems to last a long time oh just just not long enough for me to use it in the boss no way out this time you're finished acid hair i won't go alone you'll die you'll all die Leave him to me. We stay together. All right. So, um, same, same business. Gadhu, get in there, provoke them. Want to get behind him? So we're doing backstabs with, uh,
we're doing backstabs with a whirlwind oh apparently this has provocation as well cast fire nova on the target this will inflict them with burn oh i mean come on we got to do both anyone else have any combos no We should probably walk out of the poison. I don't know if we're doing as much damage as we could be doing. I wonder if, um, are they still provoked? It, 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 I should be doing more damage, I thought. If a caster has burn, what I should do Oh, this cut does this cast burn yeah piercing fireball i'm gonna do this and this will put burn on gahu and then that'll buff his attack yeah oh that's pretty good oh he's running away again oh for real Get out of the way of whatever that is. So there's a uh, there's his attack, his his uh, magic musical weapon. I don't know if uh, mana recovers over time. It seems to me that we have full mana right now. It also seems to me that these like aerial attacks are happening frequently enough that avoiding them is not actually very there's not much point in doing so like i could try but i don't seem to i don't have enough time to like attack and avoid at the same time okay so that's that now we're gonna do our same business provoke and then uh, you know follow up Let's uh, just do the whirlwind this time because I don't want to like that does more damage If the target is flank cast berserk on caster amazing. Yeah So they're they're berserked Are they I don't know hard to tell it really is hard to tell We've almost killed him. I think I've done a pretty good job of comboing all those those things together. Rah, you've got no chance against King Mago. He'll slaughter you like he did your brothers. You're bluffing, you bastard. The Blade Princes don't die as easily as that. Finish him. I'm the sword in the shadows. Is that it? Celebrate your victory. Say a prayer to Moon for acid hair. Okay, so this, uh, this, like build relations with certain characters i think celebrate your victory go for it plus two relation we did it well that's really cool i like that a lot um interesting tactics got some got some depth to it you know you can combo synergize your your attacks your moves um i even like the fact that like you can you can like yeah friendly fire is is a pain but at the same time it works to your benefit because you can actually like use it to put status effects on your allies so that they get a buff on their their attacks which is really cool that's actually like that's that's some really clever shit right there i really appreciate that um blade princes or sorry blade prince academy they said blade princes so many times that my brain is now just blade princes all the time um if you played it, let me know in the comments what you think of it. And if you enjoyed this, definitely hit the like button. Consider subscribing for more content like this. And I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.